One of the more famous Midrashim that I brought in Sikhes, in Chesidus Bichlal, is the Medrash that says that Magid Dvar Leyak and Chukum Shvat of Yisrael, that whatever the Eibishter does, that's what he tells Eden to do. That all the mitzvahs that he gives Eden, that's him, he himself is Mekayim, those mitzvahs. One of the things that the Rebbe brings this Medrash for is the inning of Dine Tumah of Akoyim. That it, it's, there's a story in Gemara that Apikaris once asked Rabbi Avo, the Kechem Kainu, the Ebesh Zoch Akoyim. So after he buried Moshe Rabbeinu, no was he table. Because Akoyim has to table after, before he goes back to doing Avoida. What was he table in? What, did he table in water? Did he table in fire? But the point is that being that he has any tumor tastes right away bavarins, that it wasn't a problem for even the minimum, even the Apicatus understood that it wasn't a problem for the Evishti Mitami to Meshir Abinu because a queen can Mitami to Shiva Kravin. And being that Meshir Abinu was the son of the Evishter, like every year is. So Livnoi Kibi Mitami. The only question was, how is he retired from the tumor? On the on Pashas Emir, on, on these Psukim of Kim Nishere, Akari Veilov, Ivnoi, Levite, Vlachese, Absulo, there's a Zoyer. The Zoyer brings that Omer Abi Yitzchok, that Losid Lovi, by the Gulo, he calls the Possek of Mishaye, Mizabam Yedin, Hamutz Bgodim, and the fish is Muhammad Bushe Golti, meaning that the Ibishter. By the Gula to be paid to the Eden is, is Kiviochel going to go to Edim and try to be paid to the Eden in peace. And then when it's not going to work, he's going to go out for a war. It's going to be a bloody war. So Zaya asks, How could he do it? Is that okay? So Zaya answers that the Eden are a chaisi shal akodish baruchum, but a chaisi absurd akrevail of loitamo. So they be asked, We know that the Abisha is not stamakay in Hedit. We know from somewhere else in the Zayat that Abish is a Kayin Godel. And a Kayin Godel can't be Metami, not even for a son, not even for a sister. The man that had the Kushal Dukhta, how could Abish be Metami to Meish Shabin and lost love to the Eden? So the Marisho explains that really this whole question of the Epikinus doesn't even start because the Abish is Doch Ruchni and Dovra Ruchni lay Kabel Tumor. Gash with the Kikanim have Dini Tumor, but the Abish doesn't have. Tuma and Taira, these things don't exist. Nervous, the reason why Rabbi Avo answered the Apicarius on his question of what, how is the Abisha table was the Daite Akizeves. His, his Akachainik at Abisha is Gashmi, you have Tuma, so he answered him with the same Shtus. And just like he was Tommy, he also, he also tabled for his Tuma. And Lefize, Tasvis, what Tasvis says that, what Tasvis Bavarins. That Hashem was betamit to Meish Abinu because it's a ben. Also, it's not really the answer. It's a daite akizevis. You ask why wasn't it shver to the apikaris? How was David shebechal betamit? Because the apikaris understood that livnoi a kohen can be betamit. But the Rebbe doesn't accept that. The Rebbe says, how can you say that the Gemara knew? But the Zoyar has the same question. The Zoyar has the same question about lachis yabsulo. So how can you say that the Zayir also goes to Daita Akizavis? Now it was that according to the Zayir, there's Taki in it of Tumul Lamaila as well. So how is Zayir Shetaki Metami if he's a Kayin Godel? So the Rebbe brings that the Cholus, everything that we have down here is a mushroom for what's going on up there. Even though it's... Down here it's Gashmi, up there it's Ruchni, but even the Ruchni is everything has a certain Tzir, a certain Tzura. So they... The fize, everything that comes down here, comes down the fear of certain surah of something up there. Lamashul, Teva Hamayim, water, the water goes down, Mokim Gover, Mokim Namuch, which is the Indian of Amshoche versus Allah, corresponds to Midas Achesed. Midas Achesed is Amshoche. And being that the Ebeshter ain't safe is Poshet Mtaches Abshitus. So also for that Indian of Poshet Mtaches Abshitus, the Ebeshter made down here something that has a mushul of. Something that's the fiery of the Nivraim is as a certain Pshita state. Where do we see that? See it by the sun. That the sun doesn't get diminished by giving out light. Unlike light bulbs or other sources of electricity, or other things that when they give, when they mamshik from themselves, it diminishes from them. The sun shines, shining for almost 6,000 years, and the lights are running out. So that's a martial for a near violation. You see, the never changes.
almost 6,000 years. So that's a marshal for any violation you see. But at the same time, it's understood that being that the Shemesh is a, a, a Brio Gashmis, and it has certain Tchunis, that I be not a marshal for the Ebishtir. It's limited, it gets covered, it can't shine through objects, and all the different things that are obviously not a marshal for the Ebishtir. That means that we have a marshal for something Ruchni, it's a certain aspect of it, not everything of it is the marshal. So, Brigali Noneinu. When we're comparing the Dine Tuma of a Kayin down here to the Kayin Gadol Shalemaylo, the Kayin and Kayin Hedin and Kayin Gadol Shalemaylo, we don't learn out every detail of Dine Kuna to the Kuna of the Eibushter. So the Eibushter says that there's a difference in the Dine Tuma of a Kayin between a Kayin Hedit and a Kayin Gadol. By a Kayin Hedit, the Dine Tuma of him, including the ex the exceptions who we could be metametu, are Pratim in the Dine Kuna itself. The Dine Kuna give, gives an exception for Bnoi and Achise and other craving. So, so too, Bichiras Kain Hedit Shelemailo. So, the Ebesh also Kivyochel has those same exceptions. So, them doesn't Nishver. But when they get to Dine Kain Godel, the Kain Godel has, uh, doesn't have even these exceptions. You can't even time it to anyone. So, the Ebesh says these Dine are not Mitzad Dine Kuna. These are Dine Mitzad. The fact that the Kayin Godel has a, a, has a higher Kedusha, but he also has a goof. So in order for his goof to contain this higher Kedusha, the goof has to be neither from extra Dini Tumor. But being at the Ebesha does not have a goof. Ele goof, ele a goof. So but the Ebesha, he can have this higher Kedusha without the extra Dini Tumor. So it's understanding that the Ebesha can be metame, even the Kayin Godel of the Ebesha can be metame to Eden and to Meish Rabbeinu without running into problems of Dini Kuhuna. Now, take it to the next step. It says, that every Yid is a Kohen. And the Balaturim explains that it doesn't mean Kohen and It means Kohen and Every Yid has a Kohen of Kohen Godel. So just like the Kinas Kain Godel Shalom Ayla from the Ebesha doesn't have it doesn't have a shaykh to Dini Tumo, so too the Kinas Kain Godel of a Yid doesn't have a shaykh to Dini to Dini Tumo. The Yichidus Shabbat Nevesh of Yid, which is the Kain Godel, doesn't go down to Golus. It doesn't be it's not Nitami. It's not Nitami in Golus. So from here we can understand we see the Chavivus of a Yid. That the Ebesha is going down. The Chol Abushe Golti is going down to be Mitami Kivyochul. To take Yidin out of Golus, it's not to take out the Pnimis of the Yid. That was never in Golus. The Ebesheh goes down to take out the Keiches Agluim. As it brings down from the Medesh, it says, Laniach Trumosi Yi Efshar. Yeah, the, the way place that we learn out that the Ebesheh is a Kain is Vikhuli Truma. Adech the Kainim. So the Ebesheh says, Laniach Trumosi, even any part of a Yid, any part of the, of the Ebesheh's Truma, the Ebesheh is not, not willing to let go, let behind. And he takes out all the Yidin with everything that they have, to the Gula Amitis Vashleimo.